Welcome back to Fallacy February with 90 Second Philosophy and Carnadies.org. Today we're going to be continuing with Fallacies of Weak Induction, looking at the fallacy of hasty generalization. So, a hasty generalization is using an unrepresentative sample to conclude a general rule, or taking a small or non-random sample to make conclusions about a population. This is really common when you see stereotypes, those are a great example of this, and it's the opposite of the fallacy of accident. Because the fallacy of accident uses a general rule and applies it to a uncommon case, well, this takes an uncommon case and tries to make a general rule out of it. Let's take a look at some examples. So, I just saw a black person mug someone, therefore all black people are thieves. It should be really clear why this is fallacious. I opened a can of pop and it exploded everywhere, therefore all cans of soda will explode when opened. Islamic fundamentalists crash planes at the World Trade Center, therefore all people that believe in Islam are violent. With all of these arguments, there is something going on that makes the case that the person observed different or special that doesn't allow it to be applied to a general rule. Unless you have a lovely randomly selected and large enough sample size, you shouldn't be concluding general rules out of anything. That was hasty generalization. Also today we're going to be looking at indirect proof part two. Yesterday we looked at Appeal to Ignorance and Indirect Proof Part 1, and tomorrow we're going to be looking at the fallacy of false cause and the answers to the indirect proof problems. Watch a new video every single day for 100 days here at carnadies.org, and stay skeptical, everybody.